I hate to disturb your cosplay viewing, but we need to talk about what I got from Tokyo. Way too much stuff. I bought around 11 inks, which I don't have with me because it's very tough to transport them. Went to Itoya in Ginza. Uh, they have a fountain pen specialty shop. I bought some Mont Blanc Irish Green, uh, Toffee Brown. That's all I got from there, actually, in terms of inks. I also bought, at a slightly discounted price, some of these new Sailor inks, uh, like the Shigure, which, is, which seems to be a dark purpley blue, I think. And Okuyama, which is a sort of burgundy. Is how they call it. Finally, I also visited Kingdom Note, where they have special edition Kingdom Note only the mushroom set. <laughs> it's, it's inks based on, on on wild mushrooms and wild birds. I got a few of those colors. They they had folders of just color swatches, and, and I was like, I want that, 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 that. And I got uh, Hakase Sepia Light which from the color swatch looked exactly like Hakase Sepia Dark except that the lady at the counter was like you don't want that in your fountain pen it probably had particles while she was um, doing my order I, I, I may have opened up the ink bottle and, and sniffed it it smelled like nothing so there's that anyway so still not talking about pens yet from Japan I have a Delphonics roll, another Delphonics roll, some strange brand that's also a roll. I also bought uh, two of the Nakaya kimonos. These are standard pricing from, 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 from Itoya. While I was at Kingdom Knot, I also noticed they had this on sale, and I was like, oh, this is pretty new. Loose leaf A4 Tomo River. Not that I need more Tomo River, but I think the one I have at home is cream. I can now get to try white, white, and if you want it with lines, you have to pay a little bit more. But I like using my own guidelines, so, so that's why I didn't. And speaking of which, bring me to this, which I'm going to take out the latest edition of the. Japanese pen magazine that I forgot the name of. Shimino Bangubako, whatever it's called. Um, interesting stationery box, volume 33. Oh, hey, look, it's the Pelican Streisman and the new Sailor Circus colorful pigment inks. And in here, it also talks about these new pads that, that I just bought. So apparently they're pretty new. At least that's what I think. Still not talking about pens. Uh, passed by when I was visiting the Pokemon Center. I passed by Loft, which is another sort of lifestyle store, and they were selling washi tape. So I bought some weird washi tape with cute figurines on them. Hopefully they're visible. They've, they've got like alpacas and, and cats and. and, and skunks and bears and other animals I think that's enough teasing <laughs> I did buy some pens including Tokyo Skytree Skytree Edition Clear Candy I bought two of them uh, mm, they are both MF medium fine nibs, just like all clear candies. So that's that. I also went to a department store and bought two Platinum 336s. Why do I always screw up on camera? 3776s. <laughs> there's, there's a blue one and I also have the black one, which I don't have to show really. It looks exactly the same, but black. That's that. Whilst I was at that department store, they also had 
the Platinum Standard Marque E. Is that how you say it? I have no idea. Um, the, the very pretty artworked pen. It has the it has the cranes and Mount Fuji. That, that's super pretty. F nib, F nib, F nib. There, there, there are fine nibs. All, all three. Ooh, what next? I went to Pencho and met one of the uh, proteges of the old master who, who, who used to do Ohashido. This was one guy. And I bought one of his black hard chased rubber pens. Oh, it's not here. Oh dear. Just kidding. It's in my wrap. But it's got a very nice uh, wooden case. Yes, I couldn't resist. I've inked it already. Comes in a nice felt pocket. And this. This. Yes. Very tough rubber. Uh, it's definitely a different material from, 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 from what I'm usually used to. It's a precious resin. It's got a different hand feel, different sense of sturdiness. Yeah, uh, it has screws on the back, threads on the back, so you can post it securely. Very light, pretty light. Feels really durable. But that's for a different time because this is just a sneak peek. So, Ohashido. He had a whole bunch of really pretty Urushi and like Urushi artwork pens that were out of my budget. I also bought a Sailor, which is not in the box. Although I might as well show you. If, if, if you get one of these Sailors, it comes in a nice felt box and Inside is a whole bunch of paperwork and a cloth for you to use. As for the pen, I inked it already. It's here in my wrap. Say the King of Pens demonstrator. Why is it called the King of Pens? It's got their largest nib. For size comparison, a 3776 fine nib looks like this. <laughs> so, much bigger. I have inked it with that Burgundy Sailor I, I mentioned. How's the right? Good. Details to follow. So that's Taylor King of Pen. Very nice demo. Uh, it's still cartridge converter, but there we go. Finally, at the pen show, I also met uh, Shinichi Yoshida, the, the pen engineer and nib designer. Had that wrong way around. Pen designer, nib engineer for Nakaya. And I bought, yes, couldn't help it. There's a pen show, he was right there, and I bought one. Comes in another, it's its own wrap. Uh, had to buy the converter separately, show that later. And this is, I believe, an Ao Tamanuri. It, it, it's just the blue. Blue, blue, blue fringes on, on black body, but mine is green, just a green and converter. He didn't ask if I wanted to convert it. He just, he just asked me if I wanted black or blue black, and then stuck a pilot cartridge. In, I mean, stuck a platinum cartridge inside. Oh no, maybe it's not this side. Poke. And this is one of the lovely Marquis uh, converters, which you 
can zoom in, you can see the, the artwork no one will ever see, except when you, the user, re-inks it. It's got fishies and, 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 and pond weed all around. So that's that. Pen loot, keeps of stuff. Next time, I, I think I'm all done with shopping for, for maybe a few months. That's what I say, but, but yeah, I've, I've, I've got some more stuff ordered. <laughs> Not pens, just nibs. So there we go. Uh, show you guys I want to see it. Oh, so pretty. Uh, this is a... You can see the different colors. And the stub nib, which, which that old man uh, he ground from a extra broad nib into a stub. So there we go. I'm good. Till next time. Oh, my head. Straight to my head. And then, uh, you can go to the one I walk. And then, you can go to the one I walk. And then, you can go to the one I walk.